In this video, we'll walk you through the simple process of deactivating your Facebook account, allowing you to take a break from the platform without losing your data or connections. Whether you're looking to take a shorter break from Facebook or a longer one, watch this video until the end so you can learn how to do it. So let's deactivate our Facebook account. Let's open our Facebook mobile app and make sure you are logged into the account which you want to deactivate. Now tap on the menu in the bottom right corner, and after that click on the little gear icon at the top right corner of the screen in order to go to your settings and privacy section. When we open this, we'll see this meta account center at the top so simply tap on it in order to open the center, where we will have the option to deactivate or even delete Facebook. When you open the center it's gonna look something like this, so just tap on the personal details button below this account settings section. Now select the last option which is account ownership and control deactivation or deletion. And if you have a couple of different Facebook or Instagram profiles they'll show up here, so you can select which one you want to deactivate. I'll deactivate my Facebook account so let's select it. And then this menu will pop up with two different options. We can choose to delete our Facebook account or deactivate it. I have a separate tutorial on how you can delete your account, and keep in mind that this is permanent. It's better to deactivate Facebook because it's temporary and you won't lose your data or account if you change your mind in the future. So select the deactivate account button and then we will continue with the next step. Now it's going to ask you to enter in your Facebook account in order to confirm your identity and verify it's you that's trying to deactivate your account and not someone else. So enter your password and let's continue. Facebook is going to ask you for a reason on why you are deactivating your account so you can select anything from this list. And we'll get to this page where it says reactivating your account. We can reactivate our account by simply logging in with our email or password or through our account center. But we also have an option to automatically reactivate our account after a couple of days. So you can select that option if you want, and if you set this to 7 days for example, Facebook is going to reactivate your profile automatically after 7 days. Now let's go to the next step, and we will just need to confirm that we want to deactivate our Facebook account. You can select these options here, like if you want to continue to use Facebook Messenger, you can just select that option. Or if you want to get notifications and your friends inviting you to different events and other stuff. Now when you are done with that, simply click on the deactivate my account button and that's it. Your Facebook account will be deactivated temporarily and you can reactivate it at any time by logging in with your mail and password or through the account center. Keep in mind that no one will be able to find you, view your profile or other information. Your profile will be hidden from your friends when deactivated. And if this video helped you out, then leave a comment down below and I'll see you in the next video.